Hello beer tubers and welcome to another beer review with me Peter the master of Hoffets today in a very different location look at that view behind me so today I went to my uncle's 70th birthday at a it's called a it's it's a restaurant slash hotel in the middle of the biggest forest in Denmark Rolskov which is what we're in now we trekked all the way up here to a watchtower to get a good shot for a beer review for you guys so what you see out there is the entirety of Rolskov but it's also all the way around behind which we we're going to show afterwards so uh, a very very awesome place it's a place it's raining a little bit but we'll, we'll do fine anyway so uh can I have the beer please yeah master <laughs> So today guys we're going to be looking at the uh, Northern Monk Northern Star Mucca Porter on 5.9% alcohol brewed with North Star Coffee from the North Star Coffee Roasters in Leeds and also uh, was it lactose and cacao uh, or cocoa powder. So it sounds really awesome 5.9% got to give a big shout out to Andre for sending this one out in the beer mail he sent me a while back. Uh, should be interesting he works at the brewery as well so uh, yeah, he said, I, I, no, that wasn't him. And I think it might have been Rob or something who said this is one of the ni nicest kind of go-to coffee porters in the UK. So we have a little wine glass for this review because that was all they had at the restaurant, really. So it'll do. It's a glass. It's better than drinking out of the can. So let's pour it here. Okay, that was a kind of bad pour. A lot of head. Looks nice, though, in the glass. Fairly black, pitch black kind of color. Nice two-fingered tan head to it. Pretty much looks like your traditional porter. So let's check out the aroma. I definitely get the lactose, that sweet, milky, lactose aroma. And chocolate. Coffee is not as intense as I thought, but there's definitely some coffee notes to it. Some roasty, toasty notes, some nutty notes as well. Smells pretty nice. Smells like a very sessionable porter. So let's give it a taste. Cheers and thanks a ton to Andre for the beer. That is dead on coffee porter. <laughs> it almost tastes like latte or something like that. It's like a very sessionable coffee porter. I'm getting a lot of the coffee, but also a lot of the lactose, like that sweet lactosey milky flavor. Gets a slight velvety mouthfeel. Yeah. The coca powder is in there too, but it's not as dominant. It's definitely the coffee that dominates, which is nice because it's a mocha porter. Yeah, it kind of tastes like mocha actually, really. Nice roasty flavors, toasted bread, toasted nuttiness, a slight burnt edge, and the aftertaste is like the kind of nice fresh brewed, uh, kind of uh, cold brew coffee or mocha, something like that on the aftertaste that kind of lingers with a kind of a bitter hop cake as well. Ooh, this is a really nice kind of dead on coffee porter. Mm. Really nice. Uh, rating wise, I'm like 92. It's well above, you know, uh, the... Uh, you know just dead on standpoint so actually really really nice stuff it's cr pretty cool to get like uh, not super strong you know coffee beers and whatnot because often coffee beers are big imperial stouts and then you can have one glass and that's it i could definitely session something like this so yeah 92 guys for the northern monk northern star mucca porter on 5.9 percent with this beautiful view up here in let i might show you guys the troll forest afterwards because uh, we're probably going to go there and have a look. So yeah, 92. Thanks a ton to Andre for this one. And yeah, let me know what you think of the uh, Northern Star Mocha Porter by Northern Monk if you've had a chance to try it. And as always, remember to comment, subscribe, check out the Facebook fan page and Twitter and Instagram. And I want to say cheers. See you guys in another beer review. Okay, guys. I stupidly unplugged my mic, uh, which would have sounded much better, but since I'm so close to the camera, I think we'll make do. But this is the troll forest that we walked into here in, in Alborg. And we're gonna find this like special tree. I can't remember the name of it. Do you guys remember the name of it? No. <laughs> it's like, it brings good luck if you crawl under it. And it's, it's some, some like in ancient times, some kind of princess crawled under it or something like that. And then it's good luck and good fortune. But we'll have to find it first. Well, yeah, we're just gonna try and keep walking through the troll forest of death. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Hi. 
Det siger de derfor ikke væk af nogle minder. Og Jill James, walking around drinking porter in the old or biggest forest in Denmark. Og Jill. Og Jill, mate. Now, where's this goddamn troll tree? Of death. Of death. So, guys, we found our way out of the troll forest, and you can see there's still like forest everywhere, but here there's a road, and that over there is the entrance to the Wusko, which I don't know what you'd call in English, but it's like super old forest. <laughs> the ancient forest. Yeah, something like that. And look at that guy. He wants to go to the ancient forest. Or he wants to go to that hole out there. The glory hole. <laughs> the glory hole. <laughs> Still on the lookout for the troll tree in the troll forest of death. And we're backtracking because we went the wrong way. And we're hiking in suits and fancy shoes that are not meant for it. <laughs> it hurts like crap. Yep. But it's worth it because we're going to see this fucking tree. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy this, see some Danish nature. And if you guys want to see more vlogs or maybe some beer reviews like this, let me know because I can find some friends or something we can check out and shoot some reviews in a place like this or maybe a forest that's more nearby where I live in Olborg. Because it's it makes for some really cool settings, I think. But let's keep looking for that freaking tree. <laughs> Are you tired? Yes. <laughs> I'm tired of death. I'm tired of death. <laughs> Everything's of death now. Whoops! That was that. That's that odd bird again. Making. I'm going to say, I expect that this tree is going to end up on the other side. Yeah. Because I can't see it from the back. I think we walked pa past the tree, guys. But maybe we'll go go back some other day and find it. If we find something cool to record on the way back, I think this is the way back, I'm not sure. <laughs> I'll try and shoot it. Uh, but yeah, no troll tree so far. Whoa. <laughs>